All right, what's up, Hot Squad? This is your man, Taurus Hot, back into it. Welcome back to another week of Dose of Bangers. I hope you had a great weekend. So, if you've not seen my posts, I am back in college. Yes, right, my fall semester started Monday. So, I will be not doing over 10 Hot Bangers every single week from this point forward until my college semester ends December. So, this week and going forward, I'm going to have 10 Hot Banger reactions, so it'll be much easier for me not to get overwhelmed doing Hot Bangers and doing homework and, of course, going to work. So, with that being said, yes, it's now time for another weekly dose of Hot Bangers. So, oh, you've actually got 11, 11 vids I'm going to react to this week for now. Then I'm going back to 10 because I wanted to add, like, an extra one for the hell of it. So, going to that... We're going to start with Hulk Banger recaps. So the first Hulk Banger recap we're going to watch is Zephyr's The Karate Kid Trilogy recap. Yes, that's right. He's finally doing another Karate Kid recap. So this one is called How Daniel Russo Cheated Three Championships. So basically, yeah, it's basically the entire trilogy of the Karate Kid trilogy. It's been so long. It's actually the same trilogy. And also, I'm still catching up with Copa Kai as well. So yeah, overall, I'm, I'm very excited to see this. You know, another Zephyr Banger, of course. So all the squad we're to do, we're going to start today with Zephyr recap of the Cry Kid Juju right now. Let's check it out. It's about to go down. Hit it, hit it, hit it, hit it, get it, get it, get it, get it. Daniel hits a, and then he hits a, and then I'm like, nah. Am I really hearing this right now? <laughs> if this man starts moving, <laughs> I'm like, oh, yeah! Yo! Yo, this was supposed to come out like three months after the last Daniel video, but... Try. But now. hey, we here now. If I did a separate video on all- I actually did that recap as well earlier this year. Go check the one out. All these fights, this would take a whole calendar year. So I'ma just put it all in one. If y'all want a big video of all final fights for something like Creed or Rocky, let me know. But yeah. we about to get started with the first up on the list. Johnny Lawrence. Yeah. And before we even get to any boxing, I want y'all to listen to this. Dog! Who is glazing? <laughs> My dog's screaming at the top of his lungs like he Mariah Carey. <laughs> Chill out, gang. You <laughs> slobbering. The match is. about to start, and we got Johnny hitting this fake salute to Daniel. Like, bro, you got no manners. Where's your parents? I'm about to beat you. <laughs> they get the fight started, and we already got a Karate Kid staple. These straight NPCs always gonna hit that charge forward and scream. To the surprise of nobody, this man fumbles the bag, and <laughs> the crowd goes mild. You're mild. trash. We not even two minutes in, and I already want to turn this off. Johnny tries to put the hands on Daniel, but even Fraud Russo is moving avoiding his hits like a baby not trying to eat <laughs> like i won't beat that little nigga ass don't eat it lays out a hit for the first point you got johnny over here moving salty as hell and the glazer in the back's trying to console him like now nah, why bro sound like a dream fan <laughs> This is a horrid comparison. You should not be moving like a Diddy Disciple supporter. Oh, this is nah, sick work. Nah. Round two starts and Johnny got him on lock on distance. He immediately rushes in. He gets him to the floor and this scene looks mad familiar. A rich white kid beating an injured man to the no. floor. Hey, bro. <laughs> Okay. That's close enough, my boy. The city needs you. Daniel hits him with the man. Get off me! Throwing him off and getting him back into neutral. And I swear I heard like Kukaracha playing in the background the way this man Johnny is moving right now. They're not even taking this seriously. And this right here is where Fraud Russo hits the cleanest play in his life. Because Johnny hits his high kick and take the top off his head. No gunner. Only for Daniel to hit no this gunner. clean evade. Lock him down and hit the sonic rings out this man's head. Okay, nigga. I see you. And I gotta give Daniel his props, but I do not want to see him move this clean. You're a fraud. I can't stand him. Grease calls a timeout, and I want y'all to hear this real quick. Johnny, you're a freeze what? Bro, who's Diddy ass Oak they got in the background talking about some cream puff? You a freaky ass nigga. My dog, you trash. Switch his like. But you know Johnny, he can sneak niggas in the dead of night, but all of a sudden he's talking like he the Saiyan Prince. Oh, yes. but my honor! I don't care about no honor, nigga. Slime his punk ass out. <laughs> I, I mean, I guess. And bro, keep the oralist walk back. That shit stank, stank don't it? it. Ugh. <laughs> we get right into round three, and Johnny hits him with the bop, bop. Mm. Laying Fraud Russo out like a mattress. Fast and efficient. That was clean as hell. And Pete Crease on the sideline with this old ugly ass <laughs> smirk. He looking too happy to see a 15 year old on the floor. This is kind of concerning. And Pete oh, the nah. D1 Glazer in the back spazzing. He's going to be the first one posting this on IG talking about some. We did it. Nigga, we? <laughs> we. 
Oh, Daniel gets boy. back up and we go straight into the next round. Johnny's again hitting the offensive. Some basic fighting, but again, I cannot focus on the fighting with these NPCs continuously talking. Where are you niggas coming from for your voice to be this clear? <laughs> Like, I really can't imagine being a fighter in this, hearing y'all yell that straight gibberish. Yes. What are y'all even saying? By the way, y'all know, y'all know. Give me, give me, give me, give me. Shut the fuck up. Johnny throws his leg over and starts moving like Broly, straight trying to stomp him out and lands a chuck right on his body. We enter the next round and my fraud alarm started tweaking and I was like, nah, someone go sell. We yes. see it come to fruition right here. Because we start this round off and Johnny hits him with the bait and switch, the pump fake, the ooh. Got his ass. And because of that fake advance, this man Daniel proceeds to hit the weakest assault I've ever seen. <laughs> and you gotta give him his props. He continuously drops that straight bus. Like, really, look at these hits, bro. He's moving like Kyrie in Boston, shooting at straight air. Like, who are you aiming these shots for, nigga Casper? And because of all that dodging, Johnny's special gauge was full. My dog done hit that. And this man proceeds to hit every single move in his command list. We're talking hitting combos just like these. He was on Daniel talking about some. I'm like, damn. Nigga, stop. But nah, there ain't no rest on this side. Johnny's moving antsy just to get him back on the field. Look at his face. This nigga is crazy. <laughs> in the moment Daniel strikes, he gets a... <laughs> Got Daniel looking like he praising in church. <laughs> he rushes at Johnny to push him to the floor, and I want y'all to peep this play. <laughs> nah. Damn. I don't know why every karate kid up do that one move oh, yeah. that looks hella clean, yeah. but this right here... <laughs> That was smooth, nigga! And Johnny bashes him in the face, ending the round. The score is now 2-2. Daniel gets back up, but I want y'all to look at this nigga. Boy, if you don't do my dog, who do you think you are? This man clip farming mid-tournament. This going straight to the IG. Caption week like seven days. Yeah. I left a few niggas behind. I'm not hearing it Oh, no. Man, shut We get into the last round in this Dumb nigga really threw the most telegraphed kick of all oh, time. I swear even Stevie Ooh. Wonder flinched. How did you legitimately throw this? Right now, Bro really also. gave out his leg like it was fresh on a platter. You want the quad or the ankles? <laughs> hmm. You know what I'll take? The knee! Laying Fraud Russo out. And look God, at damn. my dog rolling on the floor. He just like... <laughs> and while that's going on, we still got the glazer in the back going crazy. <laughs> Bro, does this nigga's jaw ever hurt? Like, I'm really tired of this Brady Bunch pencil eating Koopa Troopa Bop Bop nigga, bro. Stop! Like, bro, ain't you tired of bouncing? God damn! And here we get the iconic final round, but I'm here to tell you right now, this is the biggest case of fraudulence and plot armor I have ever seen in my life. You got this man Daniel posing in the corner like, this. Wow, wow, wow. And Johnny really saw this pose and said, Huh, I guess I'll just charge right in. And walks right into his leg. Like, I'm talking full stride. He straight up said, Ain't nobody gonna touch my stride. Like, bro! Look! I'm really crying. He's fighting like he's in Street Fighter. Did you forget you're in a three-dimensional plane? Like, my nigga, you can slide to the right. You can slide to the left. Anything would have been better, nigga. Crisscross. Shut up, real smooth. Let's go. I right, got sidetracked. Bye, 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 bye. <laughs> but this man could have done anything else, and it would have. That's not. That was our classic, though. That was our classic, though. Real stuff. Shut up, real smooth. It'd been a better play. This nigga just ran into his leg. This man nice. Daniel moving like the Celtics, bro. Mickey Mouse win, and that concludes the chapter of his first opposition. The new foes appear. Uh -oh. Now, this doesn't really count, but I want to talk about this scene. Karate Kid 1.5. And it starts off right when the tournament ends. With Miyagi and Daniel about to leave. But right when they outside, they see Kreese posted up wilding. Yes. And the way he was he yelling was at Johnny, he was on the verge of tears. How did you lose that, man? Oh, my God. You suck. And then my man's really started crashing out, breaking the trophy and then choking Johnny. He's Damn like man. them high school basketball trainers that be living their life through their students, bro. You're, You're weird. weird. Yeah. But this choking scene is actually hilarious, bro. Peep this. 
<laughs> Damn. I need to my boy so bad. But right here is where the goat pulls up. I would put a freaking assault charge on, on Priest, man. I would put an assault charge on his ass. I mean, god dang. <laughs> Miyagi tells yep. Kreese to let him go, and the glazer in the back is a generational talent. This <laughs> nigga will really suck whatever's in front of him, team hopping and all, because he's all like, yeah, Miyagi's right Get off me, peasant! Ah! And after that, Miyagi sits up in his chair and throws Kreese off of him, and Kreese puts up the dukes. He was ready for action. He strikes. No. No. And look at my man. Yeah, man. Oh, oh, man. Did you see me? Yeah, yeah, yeah you done stepped out to a real nigga. He tries again. Yes! Ooh. Try! And his hands looking just like mine when my girl's on that thing that ends a sentence. Wait, wait. Yeah, yeah. I get down like that. <laughs> that was a sick Negro. <laughs> yeah. Oh, God. All that ketchup in his hands. Huggy Lou bros him about to wipe him off the map. Huh? Huh? This. <laughs> Top tier trolling, bro. That's yeah. why he's the goat. And that wraps it up, and it leads us right into Karate Kid 2, with yep. the next op being chosen. Now, this dude with his scorpion ripoff, <laughs> oh, I yeah, don't this even dude. know why he's mad. This man was raging the whole movie for no reason, brother. Relax. But after all that hating in the movie, it brings us to this scene. And all this scene confirms to me is that no matter how old I live my life, I can never have ops. Because <laughs> Daniel's watching his girl dance having a good time, but Tell me why this nigga starts hitting a Robin Hood type oh, <laughs> for no reason. All this just for the ISO call on Daniel. All he did was land in your country and be white. Yeah, I, guess I, guess. I, I guess that's a problem. What? But Chosen holds the innocent woman hostage and tells Daniel to pull up for smoke. Daniel throws over the bridge and Chosen's like, now nah, we fight to the death. And you would think after hearing that we about to get the coldest bubble in this video, but this is by far the worst worst fight bro <laughs> it was so bad i actually struggled to commentate over this mm. we just gonna go through this fight and y'all gonna see the ben simmons counter go up for every bad <laughs> place it starts by chosen throwing the shorty and nailing daniel in the face mm. but daniel moving like jada pickett near any male that isn't will smith Damn. just throwing his legs Damn. open and he gets thrown Damn. down to the floor chosen about to stop my boy out and he's like i'm on the edge Looking like he a Smash Bros character. We just started and he's already about to get swept. This is sick. But oh, by the way, uh, I think Will and Jada did produce the the remake with um Jaden Smith. I think they did produce that. If I'm correct. Akimiko being the only W in this universe chose chosen to get him off Daniel. That deserves a round of applause yep. and an ovation even. But what happens next is crazy because chosen gets out the rope and. You stupid bitch. <laughs> 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 Hitting her was already crazy and tell me why this nigga started to chase her down nah. like dog Where you going to beat her? <laughs> nigga, what's wrong with you? And the only reason he didn't beat her is cuz Daniel pulled up last second I cannot believe these niggas right. ain't no way Daniel right. and Chosen get back into a standoff and Chosen starts trolling him and I can't even cap to y'all His physique's looking clean <laughs> as hell, but he was really hitting the gym to distract you from the fact that he can't box Add that to the counter, bro. That was so bad he didn't even have to dodge. Like at this point, I swear even a homeless nigga kid whoop y'all. And I know I just said that, but I might have to take it back because this exchange right here. Yes, uh, it's Ooh. kinda clean. I can't lie. I'ma have to let it slide. Not actually though. Yeah. Watch this. Because Chosen throws Daniel to the rock, got him looking like my girl when I put on my sketchers, and then <laughs> Daniel hits the crane, and Miyagi's hyped as hell. He's like, tell bring him, bring me my blood. <laughs> <laughs> Like work. you see, it's that really work. that easy. But nah, Johnny wants to call this an illegal kick. Like nigga, it should be illegal for <laughs> someone of your IQ to box. But Daniel and Chosen thrash at each other, and while they catch in they breath, peep the unks in the back, bro. Hey, bro, you seeing this? I ain't gonna lie, these young niggas tripping. I gotta get out of here. <laughs> and I swear these karate kid fighters are something else. They either gonna do the most illogical attack known to man, or throw something so obvious even Helen Keller can move out the way. Oh, nah. Cause Chosen hits a flying kick that you could easily sidestep. Yep. And Daniel throws this punch stupid high, making it easy to block. Like, at this point, I'm sick of this shirt, bro. Put me in there. They get back to the fist of cuffs, and Daniel hits a three-piece mm. spin move. Like, okay, ballerina, I see you, bro. And 
chosen gets him in a choke. And he was holding in for so long. I swear Daniel was seeing KSI straight black. Oh, and Miyagi nah. tight as hell. He was like, oh my God, bruh. Step back, nigga. <laughs> Daniel flips him over, but that ain't even mean nothing. Chosen put the beats on this nigga. Mm. But Daniel mm. wasn't going out like no-ho either. He was really putting the three-piece combo, nigga. Cuck. And Man. by the end, both of these two were tired all the way out. Mm. And this is where Miyagi pulls out the drums, started playing a whole banger. Yes. And what this next scene's gonna show y'all got the most fraudulent plot armor wins I've done ever seen in fiction. And I'ma get one of my special guests to do this scene. Talk to him. Yeah! <laughs> <laughs> my boy Daniel had a mission. He made sure he was cooked. Baked. Ooh. Fried. Master <laughs> aside, bro, there is no way you call this man the deadliest opponent Daniel fought when a basic left-right combo <laughs> took him out. This nigga ain't dodge, ain't parry, not even a weave. You expect me to believe a black belt made this big of a mistake? Yet another win carried by plot. I'm gonna be so honest. And lastly, we have Mike Barnes. And we mm. talked about Chang, we talked about Hawk, we talked about Tori. Mm. But he single-handedly got to be the biggest crash out in Karate Kid history, mm. bruh. We can say what we want about Chang, but he ain't throw Concrete Smith into a river, bruh. He should've, but that's neither here nor there. Well, we gonna fast forward all that for now, and we just gonna get to the final round. But I want y'all to peep this. Before the round starts, the ref says, I know, bow. Hey, bro, I said bow. No, nigga. <laughs> the first round starts, and we get a heavy offense from Barnes, pushing Daniel out the mat. And as much as I would love to diss Daniel here, this ain't his fault. Because if you go in against a chalk eating Koopa Troopa, ba ba, nigga, like this, it's not even worth it, bro. Look at his cut. No shape up, no lineup, not even Whoa. alcohol. He just stepped out for smoke because the next round goes the exact same way and i want you to peep how this man is screaming you hear the intensity in his voice you think daniel did him wrong nah this man doing all this hating for fun it's like them twitter hoes that be posting nudes free of charge <laughs> it's the love of the game <laughs> round three starts and barnes is such a menace niggas forgot that he cannot box because my dog what are these strikes like, no way you legitimately threw this and thought it was good form, bruh. He looked like he hit in a demented hit the folks, bruh. Yes. Ain't no way. See, I watch this and it makes sense why everybody in Cobra Kai is sorry. All the mentors mm. were doing moves like this in their prime, but now they're 60 years old and got CTE. Yes. It's over. Daniel hits him with a weave and got him on all fours. Mm. And anyone in this situation would go to strike while he's down. But what mm. does Daniel do? Oh, bro. Oh, Damn, bro. man. Bro. You're being uh, theatrical while you're so getting your so ass What? <laughs> I'm crying. Niggas don't emo anywhere. You see why I be hating this nigga? You cannot box. Stop. They need to change the name or something from Karate Kid to the Karate in the Kid. Because I don't know where the karate's coming from, but I know damn well it's not you. And just for that, he gets hit in the nuts. Got him like, ooh. Had Silver hitting the speed in the corner. This is crazy works. And then we got this straight refrigerator of a nigga. Come yes. onto the mat just to glaze. <laughs> Look at you, Daniel. You can't handle it, right? Yes. Nigga, yes. shut up. Yes. This is the freakiest yes. video I ever done. Yes. But this round starts and then we see something oh crazy. Daniel hits a... And Ooh. then he hits a... Ooh. And then I'm like, nah. Am I really hearing this right now? And then I heard a... Yes. I was like, nah. We I can't be who I think it is. This nigga starts moving. I'm like, oh, yeah. Yes. Damn. This next round starts with Barnes hitting a spin move. Only to trip and fall on the floor. This Looney Tunes ad nigga. They end the confrontation because he was on the floor. Only for Barnes to nail him in the oh, face. Nah. Like, nah, this is crazy, bro. Yeah. Daniel ain't do nothing but breathe air. And this nigga is hating. This next round low-key hilarious. Look at this. <laughs> right into the arms of Silver and he says this. Now the real pain begins, Danny Boy. I always thought this scene was so cold, bro. This is mm. crazy. And these next few rounds are just some violation. Mike Barnes put in the beats on Daniel, no Drake. But in the middle of one of the rounds, I hear this. I love it when he pounds the pounds the pounds. <laughs> 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 like 
bro, at this point, what do y'all want me to do? Diddy got his fingers diddling all over this entire movie. There's nothing I can do. But Daniel's on the floor, and this is where we get one of my oh, personal man. favorite scenes. Miyagi hyping this man back up to a full speed. And I want y'all to see how big of a crash out Barnes is. Not even a second after Miyagi walks away. This <clears throat> nigga's already in his face. But he was talking some fierce. I can't even hate if I tried. And here we get this last round, and it's so bad, bruh. But before we even get there, I want y'all to hear this. <laughs> like, how do you glaze so much it doesn't even make sense anymore? This nigga talking about some hallucination, man. How about you gobble my ball, ball sack? sack? All of you niggas, because I'm done. <laughs> but the fight ends with Daniel hitting this old weak ass pose, attacks in the worst way possible, and Daniel gets the point. I have never seen three championship wins in such a Mickey Mouse way. <laughs> oh. Oh, shit. <laughs> Okay, that's how it is. Oh wow, that this was fucking. This is freaking great. This is hilarious, man. He's hallucinating. I'm like, why? Hallucinating why? Oh man, uh, it's been a while since I've seen the Karate Kid trilogy. It's been a while. It's been so long I've seen the OG trilogy, man. But other than that, this was a W recap. So fire shout out to you, man. Keep up the great work with these. So yeah, hey, Hawk Squad. Uh, that was that was absolutely hilarious. That was so hilarious, man. Oh boy, boy, boy. Mm. And also, they got, if you don't know, they got the new Karate Kid coming out next year, I believe. I think it got delayed. Sony delayed it for Christmas to next year. So hopefully it's good. With Rob Macho coming back and Jackie Chan is coming back. So, ooh, okay. Okay. We're just going to see how that goes. So, Hot Squad, that is my conclusion of my Hot Banger recap reaction to Zeth Fire's Karate Kid trilogy recap. So, if you enjoyed this, please hit everybody and share your thoughts. Have you seen every single Karate Kid movie? How you rate all of them? From 1 out of 10, and what's your favorite series? Of course, my, the OG one's going to be the best. And, uh, yeah, I also, have you seen Cobra Kai every, every single season? Because I know, like, episode, no, season 6 just recently came out. I know I'm so behind in Cobra Kai. Trust me, I am. I've had so much, so much stuff to get through. It was, like, so much personal stuff I had to get through, man. It had kind of interfered my free time getting to catch up on all these TV shows. So, yeah, overall, do a recap. Jeff Fire, keep up the great work, my guy. So, Hall Squad, please stay tuned because I have my Hulk Banger recap marathon to continue with. For the first time ever, Sam Bram Cyberpunk 2077 ended recap. So, Hall Squad, please stay tuned.